Enough of the code switching. Been hitting my soul, been on the ropes. I'm ready to grow, so get to know me. Keep your head up, I want you to grow with me. Yeah, what's up with it? Do it cause I love it and I stuck with it. We in with the sub and in the cut with it. Please, none of the talks, I heard enough of it. Like, what you gon' do? Where you at? Who you with? You ain't really about this, don't talk about it. Really on the move, on the map, never slip. Keep your hands to your lips, don't talk about it. Real eyes, real lies, real lies. All the time, stand on it. If we said it, we don't walk around it. Loose lips, ink ships, red cup, blue strips, new phone, who this? No, we don't allow it. Really on go, I don't know what's an off day. Now we on road, came from. Yo, what is good, John? Welcome back to it again. Another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy, J.I., and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys. Now, if you guys are new to the channel, go ahead and do your boy a favor. Hit that subscribe button, turn on those post notifications, and go ahead and drop a comment in the comment section down below. My name is J.I. Back there, we have my 2021 Camaro SS1 LE. We do call that joint Vader. And by the title and the thumbnail you guys already know in today's video we will be replacing the differential fluid in my elsd so if you guys don't know the camaro ss1 le is basically the track version of the ss just like the 1le uh, the zl1 1le is the track version of the zl1 so with that being said, it comes with a whole bunch of bells and whistles. If you guys want to know the full rundown on what the 1LE comes with and what the 1LE, 1LE is, I do have a video on the channel. You guys can definitely go tap in and check that joint out. But with that being said, since it is the 1LE, we do have the ELSD, um, which is basically an electronic limited slip differential is what we have on this car. So with that being said, we do have to add an additive on top of the synthetic um, axle fluid. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and cut the car on now, get you guys a little start up, and then we'll pull this straight into the bay, man. man. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys go tap in to the previous video where I installed the carbon fiber gas cap on the gas door, you feel me? And also, I just signed a big sponsorship deal with an exhaust company. So, new axle back coming to Vader very, very soon. I hope you guys are ready because it's going to get a whole lot louder. No cap. Let's go ahead and pull Vader in and get started. Yes, sir. 20,000 miles, man. So, basically, if you guys don't know, man, like I said, if you're new to the channel um, and this is your first time tuning into a video of mine, like I said, this is my 2021 Camaro SS1 LE. I am actually the second owner of this vehicle. I bought the car with 10,000 miles on it, so I've put roughly 10,000 miles on the vehicle. With that being said, man, um, I'm pretty sure the differential fluid has not been changed on this car. So I'm going to go ahead and, you know, start the trail. I will be replacing my diff fluid every 20,000 miles. I just feel like that's the perfect amount of miles to have had on the car, you know what I'm saying? So. Yeah, every 20,000 miles, y'all are going to get one of these videos more than likely. So, let's go ahead and get the car in the air. Alright, y'all. So, basically, this is everything that you're going to need. I'm missing a 3 in, a three eighths ratchet um, from, I guess, the list of tools you're going to need for this job. So, basically, you need two quarts of the synthetic axle lubricant. Um, part number is on the screen. And then you're also, if you do have the 1LE, then you're gonna need to get this additive. It's only four ounces. So you need two quarts of the actual differential fluid and then four ounces of the additive. Again, all of the part numbers are on the screen right now. And then you also need a, I guess you could say transmission fluid, differential fluid, whatever you wanna call it, um, filler. So basically one hose goes into the fluid and the other hose goes into the field port and you pump the fluid into the differential. So with that being said, man, let's go ahead and get both of these uh, plugs taken off the diff. Let that joint leak out all the fluid. Uh, we're going to check the plug and see how dirty the fluid was as far as metal fragments go. Apparently, 1LEs collect a lot of metal, metal fragments inside of the differential. So we're going to see how bad my car is today. As y'all can see, we got Vader in the air. 
quick update on the oil pan. It is still leaking. I did tighten down, tighten up some of the bolts, um, but I'm just gonna take the car to Frank and have him, you know what I'm saying, go ahead and replace the entire oil pan. Um, that's what warranty's for. So basically, coming to the differential, this is going to be your drain plug, and then right here is going to be your fill plug. So we're gonna go ahead and grab a 3 8 ratchet. Um, and go ahead and break this loose and let it drain and then I'm gonna break the fill port loose as well That way it can be like a full, you know, what I'm saying vacuum type and then all the fluid flow out So let me go ahead and grab a pan and get that started want you to glow with me. Yeah, all right, okay, okay, we get it No contest Wait, see it's going on me. Sir, sir, nigga. Glow with me. So about the fill port off that joint stinks, boy. They do not capping when they say differential fluid is the most disgusting smelling fluid out there. Jesus. Boy, that differential fluid is no joke. That joint nasty. <laughs> but yeah. Nine days is number, check the climate. I'm sick of this. They had brain scheme to get the riches quick. I played along. Okay, okay. It's pretty black, <laughs> as I was expecting. But thankfully, it doesn't look like there's too much metal on here. I don't know if the camera's gonna focus, uh, but it's not too much metal fragments on there, thankfully. With that finish draining out. I'm gonna go grab the fluid and everything that we need. So yeah, it was definitely pretty bad, y'all. Uh, yeah. <laughs> After you let it drain out, go ahead and put your fill plug back on. I mean, not your fill plug, your drain plug back on. Tighten it down. That's good, nice and snug. Don't need that joint super, super tight, you feel me? Sorry, y'all, the camera has a very hard time with autofocus, as y'all know. But, cleaning up the area, you feel me? Now, for the fill process, you're gonna grab your pump, you're gonna take one of the hoses, and feed it into the fill. And you're gonna wanna hope that that joint doesn't fall off, you know what I'm saying? And then you take the other hose and you're gonna feed it into your fluid. There we go. Getting that young fluid. Pump in there, man. Oh, 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 that bitch. Oh, I feed it into the field. And you're gonna wanna hope that that joint doesn't fall out. Too hard for y'all not to see me a star, bitch. I'm raising a bar like they really pay me to talk my life in a shambles. But I got handles, I'm finishing at the rim. I remind you time and again and again that I'm really him. Oh, you ain't up. This not just for the show, but bet you entertain anybody now. Last bottle. One LE, they said. Get the one LE they say. For me is below me, blow me, you in the way. I live my dreams, I got it locked, the master keeping on me. Back in the field, running audibles with the team. Everything I got out the mother told my truth. I shake that fake shit, they praise you, then minimize you behind you. Just know I notice you. Stay woke, no joke, it really be the ones you closest to. Had to stop sleeping on myself like I ain't know the truth. Oh, this to me like it's really nobody code is this. And if you disagree, and we take you three ace ratchet. Tighten up the fill plug. Make sure that's nice and tight. Make sure the drain plug is nice and tight. Clean up your area, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Cut the car on. Back it out. Go for a little drive. You should be good. Honestly, should have put the additive in first. Um, you know, you live and you learn. I should have put the additive in first to make sure that the additive was in there and then filled it up with the fluid. Um, but I've seen some people not put the additive at all, so and not have any issues, so I guess, you know, we're just gonna try our luck with this one and see what happens. Um, at this point, I'm gonna just go ahead and spray everything down with some brake clean, clean up the area a little bit, get the car down, take it out the lift, go for a little rip around the block and make sure everything's good, I don't hear no noises, and uh, we'll go from there, close out this video. If I shake that fake shit, they praise you, then minimize you behind you, just know I notice you. Stay woke, no joke, it really be the ones you close. Warm start.
Whatever that was on the left of this car, man. Let's go ahead and get it off the lid. She's carbon everywhere. Carbon everywhere. Jeez. 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 You know what I'm saying? It's a cockpit for real. For real, for real. Real deal cockpit. No kizzy. You know, just no music. Windows cracked a little bit. Make sure we're not hearing any weird noises. If you don't like exhaust pops, man, I don't know. I don't know what to tell you. If you don't like backfires, bro, I don't know what to tell you. But, from this little lap that we're doing, I believe we're all good. Um, like I said, as you guys saw, you know what I mean? It started uh, leaking out of the differentials fill plug, which means that it is full. Bro, every time I pull out of this parking lot, it's some kind of police like bro what i oh, appreciate you gangster thank you and she had the red wheels on the porsche okay anyway every time i pull out of that parking lot bro there's always some form of law enforcement passing me up bro always and they always look that was a state patrol um whatever the hell i guess they patrol the borders i don't know but yeah bro like damn i can't get no break man like Some pops for y'all, man. <laughs> yeah, man. Let's go ahead and get Vader parked back up, man. With the new exhaust, it pops in neutral and not just in drive. That would be live. Just like stationary revs and still pops. I would like that. But yeah, man, that's actually gonna go ahead and do it for today's video. There you guys have it. It's really easy to change your differential fluid as long as you have the right tools. But that's pretty much any job that comes in this car life. As long as you have the right tools, you'll be straight. You know what I'm saying? Really and truly, that's with anything in life. Make sure you set yourself up for the future and not for the past. But anyway, we got Vader here, man. All good. Differential fluid is done. Super stoked about that. Also, got my carbon fiber gas cap on there now, man. I'm super stoked about that as well. But... Without further ado, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button for the kid. We're on the road to 10K subscribers. I'm not going to keep dwelling on, you know, adding the 1K and adding the 1K. We're just going to shoot for the 10 and go from there. I know we're currently sitting at 3,500 um, and something, so I appreciate you guys for that for sure. Um, but, yeah, man, from now on. We're on the road to 10K, so if you guys haven't already, hit that subscribe button for the kid. Turn on those post notifications if you're already subscribed. That way you get the notifications whenever I drop a video, whenever I drop a community post, whenever I drop anything. Damn, that was almost an accident right there, boy. Jesus. Anyway, <laughs> with that being said, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this one up here. I'm going to go ahead and roll that outro, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.